Julia's House for Lost Creatures by Ben Hatke Julia's house came to town and settled by the sea. That evening there was a warm fire and toast and tea, and all the house was quiet, too quiet. So Julia ran to her workshop. She got out her tools and her paints and went to work. She made a sign. She hung the sign up outside the front door. It said, Julia's House for Lost Creatures. And she waited. She didn't have to wait long. Scratch, scratch. The sign worked. Patched up kitty came to stay, and it was nice to have a friend, even if he wasn't like other kitties. Before long, there was another knock at the door. It went boom, boom, boom. It was a very sad troll. The city had torn down his bridge, and he asked if he could please stay, just until he could get back on his feet. Julia had just settled the troll into her best chair when there was another knock. There were also scrapes, scratches, whines, bangs, barks, and bellows. Soon Julia's house was filling up with lost and homeless creatures of every description. They asked for towels and soap, tea and toast. They had ideas of their own. They spilled things, and they didn't clean up. And then the troll found Julia's old record player. Stop, shouted Julia. Everybody, stop. The creatures stopped what they were doing and stood shuffling their guilty feet. Julia ran to her workshop and closed the door. She stayed in there for a long time. When she finally came out, Julia had a new sign. Now everyone had a job. Julia's chore list. The dragon made toast. The mermaid washed the dishes. The foliage tended to the fire. The goblins mopped up. The ghost was in charge of dusting. And the troll picked out the music. At last, there was a warm fire and tea and toast for everyone, and all the house was quiet again except whoosh, drip, 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 creak. So Julia got out of bed and made more signs. She put it up outdoors and then waited. Tap, 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 tap. Help wanted. Repairs, odd jobs, and plumbing. She didn't have to wait long. The End